Good morning, everyone. Today we're gonna to make a bat out of a coffee filter. So get your coffee filter out, and what we're gonna do is use washable markers. Um, so choose purple, blue, black, and we're gonna color the coffee filter really well with using different colors. You don't have to color it pretty because we're gonna get the coffee filter wet and then all the colors are gonna to blend together and that's when it's gonna look really nice. So I'm gonna do some blue around here and then add some purple. And then I think I'm gonna just add a little bit of black in the middle. I would probably go heavy on the marker because um, I did one where I didn't do it so heavy and it didn't quite bleed it quite as well. So there is my scribbled coffee filter. Then I just have a bowl of water where I'm gonna simply just dip my fingers in it and just kind of sprinkle the water right on the coffee filter to get it wet. And you can see all of the colors are starting to bleed together. And then you're gonna have to put that aside to dry. And then when it's dried, it will look like this. And while you're waiting for that to dry, what you can do is get out your clothespin and paint the clothespin black. When that dries, you can glue on the little googly eyes and then get out some white paint and make some fangs for the bat. And then with the dried coffee filter, we are gonna fold it in half, fold it in half again, so it's a quarter, and then we're going to make some scalloped edges. So that way it looks like a bat. So I need some pointy edges there. And then what we're gonna do is take your paper clip and put the flat side on the inside of the clothespin. And you have yourself a fun Halloween bat. Enjoy.